tonight. That was absolutely awesome. Kid, this is it, man. Congratulations. It was a long time coming, man. How do you feel right now? Uh, about time. Get that monkey, you know. Tear it off. Tear it, it off, buddy. It's gone. It's gone. It's out of here. I'll tell you. And, you know, I, I was looking at some stuff. The last time a Hirschman was in Victory Lane here was your father back in 1976. You, I don't even know if you were born then, but, man, that, that's a long time. No, it definitely wasn't. Uh, and it shouldn't have took this long, and I don't... I don't know why it did, it's just uh, when I had a great car, something always happened and there's some nights I just didn't have a good car and uh, definitely left here uh, disappointed in myself. But uh, like I said, uh, I've definitely taken my share of uh, ribbing from uh, my lack of success here from uh, everybody. So uh, I'm glad to get, uh, get a, finally get a win here. Uh, my guys, uh, one of the owners isn't here, he had to work, I wish she would have been here to see it. But I uh, uh, also got to thank my niece, uh, she drew the pole for me. Made it really easy for me, and tomorrow is their second birthday, so happy birthday to her. That is very sweet. And look, I'll tell you what, this race itself, leading was, was uh, getting the pole and leading was one thing, but staying out there was another. Do you realize how these guys were all over you? At first you had Eric, you had Johnny, it was all side by side. Zane was in there, everybody was taking a shot at you, man. Well, he had some of the best uh, to deal with. Uh, you know, it certainly wasn't easy. Uh, you know, Eric's been dominant here lately. We had him a couple times. Uh, Johnny's been, uh, well, he's won here. Jeez back when my dad won here probably so uh you know um and then uh, zane uh, zane come on real strong there at the end and i know he was under me one time uh and then i just had to uh, try and pick it up a little bit to keep him behind me but uh definitely a relief i had to get uh, finally get a win here close to home how about late in the race now with the track with the track the way it was there was so much racing tonight there was a lot of jump maybe out there on the track but uh, i mean everything yeah, right. stuck, to good, stuck pretty good a look that was pretty good i know there was some oil spills and stuff earlier but uh, overall the track was pretty good tonight uh, you know a lot of racing on it a lot of rubber on it uh, it was pretty sticky and uh, you know the car worked well uh you know, it was uh, right here in the middle of the race there is when I started to think, you know, this thing is uh, really good. And uh, I did what I said I was going to do before. We went back and just made a couple little small changes. And I've done that before, and it's gone the wrong direction. And uh, I definitely kicked myself for it. But uh, but uh, definitely what we did uh, was the right way. And, uh, you know, I know we still had some guys that were just as good or better. But, uh, you know, my... Uh, my niece definitely helped me out by getting the starting position there, and uh, definitely will work out. Good deal. is three thousand dollars, buddy. And by the way, you got to pick a card now to see. I think you got to finally figure out what we're doing with this poker thing, right? No, not really. I don't have a clue. Just pick a card, any card. Ace of Spades. It's a Spade suit, all right? And that's the best card to pick. Great job, buddy. Congratulations, man. F. But hey, there's Tony. How about this kid here tonight, huh? Real. Last time you won here was in '76, and now he finally gets it. Finally, you know, I bust on him all the time. He can win every place else but Mahoney. You know, he finally got one here. Feels good, man. You guys deserve it. I got to get to this guy right over here, Johnny.